hey, we're back. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, dying slowly. Um, we are back with Frambo. We are going to continue where we left off in this room of wonders. Well, if you watched the la if you had watched the first video, you know that I just got out of this room here. And basically, um, parents were murdered by some evil thing that was out the window. And I'm in a crazy house. Well, that's a horrible thing to say. I I'm in a, like, I think it's called Oswald Asylum or whatever. And I'm trying to escape to find my cat. And here's a room. Beautiful. Ooh, let me see. And you can see this one here likes to draw crayons. Name Ad Adelaida Fugus. I, I don't know. Age seven, the patient was a victim of sexual abuse by an unknown person, which almost killed her. This event has created auditory hallucinations and thought disorder. Treatment uh, has become close to the patient through drawings therapy and is making progress. That's because she's making progress. I mean, she does seem to be enjoying those drawings there. Let's talk to her. Hello. You see them. You do, right? See what? The creatures that follow everyone. The shadows? You mean the shadows, which I will show you in just a moment. Uh-huh, I can't see them, but I know they're there. Do you know what they are? Yeah, I guess. Well, tell me, please. You like to draw? I love to draw. Yes, I love it too. But tell me more about the shadows. A crayon, a crayon. I want to find a crayon. I draw all the time, as you can see. I want to find my cat. Draw a cat if you don't have one. I'm gonna keep looking for my cat, cause it's my it's my precious. Your cat's in danger. The shadows took him. I know. <gasps> Who told you that? The one that follows me. Bye. And I'll just show you real quick. That one. Which, I think that these shadows are gonna, like, help you figure out what happened to these children. I mean, like, Adelida here was a victim of sexual abuse and it shows, like, bloodied hands around her. You should blame yourself. Be quiet. He takes away your innocent inner child and devours it. Nobody believes you, although the wounds are bleeding. So, I think those are maybe the voices of maybe the person who abused her. And who is rocking over here? It was just back and forth. Back and forth. <sighs> uh, still dying. But we need something from her. Yes, my baby. My child of mine. Sorry, my, my kitten's in the room. As always, she thinks my attention should be solely on her, which it, it is a lot of the time. So she doesn't like when I play video games and, like, have my attention. Uh, let's just get through this. This is all pretty much the same dialogue. Look at little Fran, she's so cute. So hopeful. <laughs> there we go. What are you drawing? Something. What is it? My dreams, now go. Oh, how do I... hold on. Oh no wait, never mind, I, I remember. That's mine, my crayons. I just like this green crayon so much, can I have it? I like the green crayon too, Fran. No, I won't be able to draw green then, that's ridiculous! Oh, that's true, but you have so many other colors. Yes, many colors, but you know, they don't like me drawing. Ooh. The nurses, they tie me up, and when I want to draw, I can't. Which, it might have to do with the fact that you're drawing all over your room. That might be it. Yes, they tie me up sometimes too. It hurts. When I can't draw, I hurt myself. Then comes the red milk. Look. Poor thing. <laughs> Please cure me, yes, and stop the red milk. I'll see what I can do. And if you were watching the last one, you know that when we were looking through the nurse's desk, who had a gun in her drawer, by, by the way, we got this. A box of band-aids. 
see. Look how nice Fran's being. Oh, thank you. You can have the ground. Now go. I have to draw. Okay, I'm sure she didn't say it like that, but that that's how we're saying it. Anyway, back in here. Let's see what this room looks like. Hello. What was that? Good question. Daddy was not there. Mommy would not care. Those are our parents. <sighs> the king likes drawings. Oh, hello. And then it's actually just an ordinary one. <sighs> Boring. What can we see out here? There are a few different um, areas of the place. You can see this one. You can see the maze. Huh? There you are. You should be in your room. The door was closed. But you left it open. <laughs> I'm sure it was not open. I know, because I locked it. How did I get out then? Ah! Don't try to trick me. Go inside your room and wait for the doctor. <coughs> I have no time for this. I have to find my way out. Then I don't believe anything's changed since... Because, like, some places, if you get the thing you're supposed to get, it's usually you're done there. Did you break out from your room? That's not nice, Fran. Um. You know what? My kitty told me to leave. He really needs me. I lost any of your excuses, young lady. I'm not making up excuses. It's, tr it's true. It's very true. I have to learn how to listen to those in charge. Lesson learned. You, I wonder what this will get me. I usually go with that. Let's see what this gets me. Big people. Uh -huh, that's what she said. Just don't do it again, Bran. Go and eat now and then get back to bed. It's the same thing. And then there's Phil. I kind of like Phil. I'm going to be honest. Poor thing, though. Like, I feel sorry for all of these kids, not just because of what happened to them and where they are at. They're, they're just like... Like, have you ever been into, like, a psychiatric ward on a hospital? It's not the fun, funnest place, but it is better than this place, it would seem. Oh, let's check the other room. Even if there isn't really anything to see, I like checking this room because I love the art style of this game. A bleeding clock. Hello up there, miss. Clock sounds odd. Let's go ahead and just go back here. There was a security guy there. Reach the key. If you were paying attention, there is a key up there. Now we just have Pig. Mr. Pig is naked. How do you know it's crunchy? Did you bite it, Fran? She is hungry. Then here's... This guy's... Okay, hold on. I'll be right back. Hey, sorry about that. I had something to go take care of. Um, where were we? Oh, yeah. Now, this guy, we need to get him the room, obviously. He's not going to give us that key. He's not going to let us get that key. I think there are two ways to get this. I'm going to try and get it the way that I don't normally, but that's probably going to fail. But we'll just try. Sorry, the key hanging up there. Can I have it? Sure, I can give you a key if you give me a kiss. <sighs> <coughs> As much as I would love to hit A, I think B is going to help put me on the path for that other, um, what's the word I'm thinking of? Result? I don't know. Kiss, are you serious? And then you'll give me the keys? Sure, come here and sit on my knee. What a loser. I hope you die with it while a giant pineapple grows in your butt. So, can't get that, so let's just go over here. I have no clue what this girl's name is. Hello, are you alright? What is that supposed to mean? Harsh. I just wanted to know if you feel okay. I don't want to tell. The doctor will cut your head open if you don't leave. He likes deep brains. Here he took mine. He ate all of my thoughts. He ate your brain? He will eat yours too. I saw you inside the doctor's office. You are dead. Oh no, then I have to go. I hope you find new thoughts. Bye. Let's check out this girl's ghost. And there's a teddy bear. Teddy, what are you doing here? Are you on your way to meet another teddy? Say hello for me when you get there. 
so casual. I will laugh at you. I will lie to you. I will hide you inside the shadows. This is... Hello. Hi, Trebay. Wake up, Isabel. The black shadow is touching you. It says that you're going to die soon. Are you afraid of death? I hope not, because it may happen even if you don't like it. She looks so casual saying that, but it's such a morbid thing to say. Look at me, I say I care while you're dying of hunger and thirst. Look at me, I say you're beautiful while I give you poison to eat. Look at me, I say I love you while I'm teaching you to hate yourself. Oh no, they did it all wrong. <laughs> I think that is it for this realm. Take that, thank you. I believe I combined these two. Yep, there we go. Okay, anyway, back to Norland. She's unconscious. I have no clue what's up with her. Like, she won't wake up. I guess this means she's heavily sedated. Maybe one of the nurses exited over does it or something and then he had something with his head like literally you see the staples there don't touch that you'll die if you do waves they didn't work what do you mean the paper should be working like they told me but what is it the paper has to do i need the paper to show me what's on the television oh i see but why isn't it working the waves must be powerful. Change the channel, please. And say if you go to stuff like this or this, he's going to say something like this. The waves, we are losing the waves. Change the channel. So he's just going to have you change it. Just to save you all time, if you end up playing this, it's eight. It's, it's of course, the last one. <coughs> it works. It works. A miracle. Thank you. Paper vision. Positive. Great, can I see? No, this is mine. If you want, you could take the papers that didn't work. Thank you, but you told me that would kill me. I never said that. You liar. I'm busy. Paper fish. Paper vision, revision, in action. So, this is mine now. Now, see, I don't know these two's names. <gasps> we're gonna meet our. F we're gonna meet my favorite one. I love her. I love her to bits. But first. Hello. Hello, friend. How are you today? I see dead animals, miss. You mean in the television? No, I mean for real. Just forget it. Very well, friend. Go play with your friends now. Ooh, yay. Cinnamon bun. I have no clue who's this kid's name, but apparently he came from downstairs, which we'll see soon. Hello, are you new here? I haven't seen you before. No. Are you from downstairs? Uh-huh. They think I'm better now. What's your name? Could you please kill me? Please. Sure. Bang. You are dead. Thank you. I can't talk now. I'm dead. <sighs> her. She is my favorite. Just look at her. And she drinks from here like a kitten. Like, watch, watch, watch. Annie loves to drink the milk like a kitten. Like, she's Annie, but she's the only one other than Phil and Adeline. That's what I'm just gonna call her, Adeline, whose name's actually no. Don't disturb me. Go away, I'm eating. Oh yeah. He's the king, by the way. Don't touch my sword. I didn't know it was yours. You should bow and speak clearly to me. I am your king. Oh, I bow to you, sir. Very well, my child. What's the purpose of your visit? I want your walking cane. What walking cane? Do you mean my sword? Yes, your highness, your sword. Why don't you give me an exchange? Anything you need, your highness. Bring me a cast on a horse. Only then will I grant you my sword. Right? And pill vision. Yeah. Oh. Well, there's a handprint. They are dead. Now, if you talk to this one, you find out what happens to this kid. That holy man took all your clothes off. Oh, how pretty all these roses are, right? Your mommy doesn't believe you. So, he was molested by, I guess, a priest of his church, and he tried to tell his mother, but his mother didn't believe him. 
And then this is what's happening over here. They hide you because they love you. They harm you because they hate you. Oh, little boy, everyone feels ashamed of you. Oh, no, the lady nurse died. It happens in life. Oh, sorry, one moment. Yes, just listen to the demonic whisper in a few more seconds. Sorry about that. And Annie, see, I don't know why, but she's the only one, like, in this realm. Watch. She doesn't appear. She doesn't have a ghost. It's nothing. So, I, I don't know. Hey, Annie, how are you? Aren't you afraid of me? No, why would I? Because I can do magical tricks and make you sleepy. Magical tricks? I don't know you could. Show me. Show you, but it's very scary. It's better if you do it. I can't. I'm not a magician. I can give you the magical stuff. Don't do drugs, kids. Really? Whoa. Or woo. Wow. Yes, the magic stuff that'll make anyone fall asleep. Horse tranquilizers. Oh, that's amazing, powerful, and grand. Here, as a gift, take it slowly. Alright, how does it work? I have no idea. And then she just gets up and she just walks around the ward. But, guess what we're gonna use this with, dears? Guess for who we're gonna give this to. <laughs> but first. Now, the king wants a castle on a horse. We need that kid's cane, man. He looks so happy with it. But what the hell's he eating? Well, that's beautiful, exactly what I dreamt of. You can take my sword now, it's yours. Go. We got a grabby grab. In one moment. Sorry, I keep getting texts. <sighs> oh, it's why I'm recording. I mean, it's kind of late, it's just one, but he has school in the morning, so. Now, let's see if I can do this right. Come on, there we go. Now it's very fresh, directly from the oven. Yes! It worked! Oh hey, got an achievement. Sleeping princess. In the demo, I think this was the only way to get him. 
I'll take this, good sir. It's a key. Now we use this key on the officer door. And hello, office. Hello. We need this. See, this is going to give us the alarm code. Important information, finally! And I want this key. It's like a spare. Extra key. And this is what that girl meant by, she saw me dead in the office. Oh, that dead girl looks a bit like me. Yeah, just a bit, you know, maybe add some flesh, a pair of blue eyes. Even though your eyes are open, you can't understand. Even though your eyes are bleeding, you can't feel. Don't hide what hurts. Let it hurt you. Hello, Phil. Phil? A forgotten girl with no family or cat will die when the moon arrives. What do you mean? Slam. Phil! Phil! I shouldn't scream if they find me in here. I'm in big trouble. Thank you, bony hand. And now onwards. Oh, the wind hole. I guess this is my way back. I wonder if Phil knew about this. Maybe. Who knows what the demons are telling him. Poor thing. That rat where he hit his head. I should go to helmet. <gasps> Little rat helmet. That'd be adorable. Proceed forward, my dear friend. Go, my young Lemmy Winks. Lemmy Wink. Lemmy Wink or Wink? I think it's Lemmy Wink. I don't know. I can't remember. I just keep going and going down the rabbit hole, Alice. Down the rabbit hole. Ah, kerplunk. And now we are in the basement. I think... Oh dear, where am I now? I guess I have to find a way out. I think we will leave this off here, people. Thank you for joining me, and I will see you next time on Frambo. See ya.